be because the, the very first day of camp, yeah. my coach said, listen, you're used to running around a lot, you're not grounded enough, and we need to get you more grounded so you can use your power more. So I don't even know the difference. I just feel like uh, every, like every day in the gym. I guess how drastic of a change in style did it feel like to you? It was drastic because you know, a lot of frustration. Um, so I just wasn't used to being in the, the fight zone, we sure. call it, um, that often. I'm used to being elusive, running around, sure. all that stuff to waste energy. And so my coach said, you know, listen, we're gonna change these things. We worked hard at it every day. Although it was very tough, we got it done. Were you expecting such a result uh, tonight, seeing that he's gone 10 with uh... I can honestly tell you that I wasn't expecting anything. Yeah. My coach, I know for sure he knew it was going to end that way just from the way they were training and that's the only, I know that's the only way he would have accepted that fight. Yeah, just uh, not having a knockout for a while having gone into this fight, is that where all the aggression that uh, you're showing really pays off? Yeah, um, you know what, I wasn't even trying to, to show that kind of aggression. It's just what he put instilled in me from day one. So if you're every day you're training and you're doing the same thing and always being in the fight zone, uh, mid-range fighting, um, it was just so automatic yeah. um, to, to do that. And I hit him with a shot thinking, you know, I didn't know the, the devastation of it until you know, I actually saw the replay. But um, to tell you the truth, uh, it all just felt natural. Yeah. Tell me about the uh, process leading up to the fight. <laughs> Any <more> questions? <laughs> uh, do, do you feel you made a statement here tonight to, uh, to the rest of the division? Uh, kind of a touchy question. Um, I would say yes, um, definitely. Uh, new team has definitely reformed and added more tools to my game. So uh, definitely that's what becomes a statement. Uh, you know, I can punch uh, people knew that, just haven't seen it, um, but uh, the way we work in our camp, you can expect more of that. What do you think is uh, next? Anything that you're trying to schedule all up on these days? Yeah, uh, we're just, every fight we take is just putting us closer again to, to another world title um, opportunity, so, um, you know, it's all about taking the fights that's going to get you seasoned, learning, um, fighting vets. Uh, this guy was the IBF Intercontinental Champion at one point and uh, some, another cha uh, IBF, but he had another IBF title of some sort. So we want to get guys that were uh, the other champion or former champions. It's the only way we, uh, we want to grow in the sport. Did you need that victory tonight after the loss, after the comeback fight? I guess described as a little frustrating. Running you know what? I wouldn't say I need any one particular. I wouldn't say I need any one particular fight. You know, um, it, you know, it's not any one particular fight. Every fight is needed. Okay. You know what I mean? There's, there's no. I need this one. But was there a level of satisfaction that being missing? The same satisfaction I'd be getting every time I win a fight, whether we go the distance or a couple of rounds like today. Thank you. Nice to get that. Yeah, man. Thank you. We'll see you around. Yeah, for sure. Just like 10, 15 second plug, man. Just a nice little. <laughs> Respecting the process is where it's at. Don't get it twisted. <laughs>